Things are getting flippin' trippy here, jellyfish. Jellyfish, are you one of them drug jellyfishes? Hello everybody, Washoot here, and welcome to The Stairway. Alrighty, so a few things about this game before we get started. It was made by someone named uh, Hannah Riku-chan on DeviantArt and Elidna Elidna on Tumblr. I'm not sure, I've never uh, heard the name pronounced there. I think it's probably Elidna, but anyway, let's do it. I can't find her at all. She hasn't left without me, has she? Uh-oh. Who hasn't left without you? Controls. All right, so pretty much exactly the same as every other RPG Maker game. I'm ready. Use the option in the menu and to select a spot to save. Okay, are you telling me that I should do this already, game? I will do it if you tell me to. To do it? All right, good. I'm sorry, I know. It wouldn't be a Washu uh, LP without me forgetting something, right? Okay, this is what it said at first. Uh, you play as Stella, who has been invited to an event by her friend. However, after a while of being there, this friend is nowhere to be seen. Could she possibly have left without her? While wondering, Stella stumbles upon a strange stairway. Alrighty, so I, I think that might have been imperative to know before we begin, so I apologize. So, let's just, uh, I guess look for this stairway or this friend. I sure hope that they didn't leave without us. That would be kind of unkind. It says, welcome. There's also a timetable. Uh-oh. Well, did we supposed to, like, one of the sign-in thingies, like we're supposed to do at the, uh, weddings and whatnot? It's locked. Oh, shit. Well, we better not disturb that way. Let's try this way. I don't think I should leave yet. Oh, I really hope she's still around here. Watch as that was the happy end where we're supposed to leave. Is something terrible is gonna happen. Oh, it's a blue room. I like it. That looks like that's gonna, like, maybe trap me inside. Maybe we shouldn't go in there. What do you think? Can we leave? That would be awesome if we could leave. Okay, well, anyway, let's just keep going. Yeah. Wow, that's like so incredibly relaxing. Kind of reminds me of that one scene from Cowboy Bebop where there's like, this is the stairway to heaven, don't you know? <gasps> it's soft. What is this chair doing here? It's a place for you to put your booty, girl. Place for you to relax. Yeah, oops. Where the heck did we just end up? Oh! That was! Well, I mean, the friend disappearing is a sad thing, but look at that jellyfish. Where am I? Jellyfish, you are here, miss. Oh my, we got a sarcastic jellyfish. You know what? You think you're funny. What? Did you just talk? <gasps> of course not. I'm a jellyfish. Isn't it just your imagination? Well, uh, excuse me. If something is happening in real life and I think that it is real, therefore it had to happen within me, right? Just go with the flow, like me. Um, well, all right. Uh, I'm gonna assume that the jellyfish was actually talking. Let's not get into that kind of moral conundrum here. Hello. Is that person sleeping? Okay, I kind of want to know where the hell we are. This is giving me kind of like a, uh, did we just die and this is like a purgatory-esque thing? Where did I leave it? Oh, hello, Stella. <gasps> Who are you? I am Roseanne. Don't be surprised. Everyone here knows about you, probably. Really? Where is this place? Who knows? Could be anywhere, like my bracelet. Ah! Where did I leave it? Oh, uh, I know. Could you help me look for it? Please, please! Uh, yeah, I guess I don't mind helping. Where did you last see it? In my arm. Alrighty, well, is it on your arm? Well, of course, but, uh, in what place exactly? Oh, who knows? Could be here, there, anywhere. Oh, maybe it was back there where you came from. I'll go look then. Alrighty, okay. I hope this won't take too much time. Alrighty, well, I guess I'll just go on. I better save, by the way. I guess I'll just go back exactly the way I was gonna go. Anyway. It's not like I'm looking for a friend. Pfft, not at all. Jackfish, have you seen a friggin'... You look a bit lost. May uh, I help you a little? Yes, actually, it is not me who is lost. It is a bracelet. 
Follow me. Okay, I can't. How am I supposed to follow you? You're disappearing into the water. I can breathe. Did we just teleport into the uh, sink? What did just happen? Oh my God. Things are getting flippin' trippy here, jellyfish. Jellyfish, are you one of them drug jellyfishes? So, was the bracelet you dropped silver? I have no idea, probably. I don't, you're making me choose. I don't know if it was silver or not. Ah, uh, okay, let me think about her. She was wearing blonde hair and it would be redundant to wear a gold bracelet with blonde hair, right? So it was probably a silver bracelet. Are you sure? No, I'm not sure. Then was it gold? I don't know. Yes, are you? Oh my God, jellyfish, give me the, watch as he has like a giant collection of bracelets and he's just like, actually I have every single bracelet. I'm a bracelet thief. <gasps> then was it this dull bracelet? Are you sure? Jellyfish, you are fucking with me, aren't you? Then what was it? It's none of those, it was just a bracelet. It's just that I'm not the one who lost the bracelet. I see. It really was a trick question, wasn't it? Sorry, miss, that's okay. Three of them, actually. Very well, in reward for your honesty, even though I lied like five times, my floaty self will let you return this to its respective owner. Look back there. <gasps> oh my God. What kind of bracelet is this? That's one giant bubble. Touch it. Ooh. You got bracelet. This is probably Roseanne's bracelet. How do I get back now? I got an idea. Let's talk to the jellyfish. Okay, then we're just gonna teleport. Well, thank you, sir. I think I'm just gonna keep it. A golden bracelet somewhat lost. Hey, 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 hey. It was golden. Freaking lion jellyfish. I had to whoop his ass. I had to whoop that guy's ass for being. Oh shit, actually this is for you. Could this be it? Oh, that's my bracelet. You found it. I sure did. Thank you very much, really. It's nothing. I'm glad you could get it back. We're a cute character, Stella. But this place sure is strange. Why am I here? You must be looking for something, probably. Well, actually, yes, I am looking for a friend. Not you though, you can't be my friend. I'm looking for a real friend. Uh, is that so? Then you should go ask a certain person. Oh, freaking pronoun game. All right, that certain person must be waiting for you. You should go ask her. She will know about your friend, probably. Who? Well, well, thank you very much, I guess. Oh wait, take this. If she gives me the bracelet. I got a small umbrella. Maybe it's a bit tiny for you, but have this as my thanks. <gasps> it's all frilly and decorated. Pretty, but also small. It's fine. Thank you again. Hee <laughs> Well, good luck finding your friend. It'd be nice if we could met someday too. Alrighty. Well, if I forget. Might protect you from small <laughs> raindrops. Ah, I like this game. I like this game so far. It's cute. I'm gonna save though, just in case. I bet I'm saving way too much. They said that this wasn't a horror game. Hello? <gasps> you, wait! Or don't, whatever, okay, it's free country. She's gone! Oh my god, if this turns out to be like the friend killed herself or something horrible like that, I'm gonna cry because this game is putting me in a very peaceful mood. And the person over there was gone. Alrighty, well, this is very fish tank inspired, isn't it? I could see all the types of different aquariums and whatnot. And when that lady over there said this is uh, small and delicate and frail and Frilly, I was like, oh, it must be like a tiny little uh, decorated geisha. But instead, we got an umbrella. All right, then. We are now in a garden. And we still have no use for our... Uh... Hello there. What are you looking at? Water? <gasps> um, hello. Oh, hello. You are Stella, right? Sorry, I am a bit busy right now. Staring at the water? I'm sorry. Is... Is there something in the water? Not really. That is exactly the problem. Ah, excuse my rudeness. I am called Monique. Oh, nice to meet you. I'm called Stella. 
Hey, 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 we're supposed to say our name. Ah, oh, when will something arrive? Even if it is just a word, anything. Ah, oh, better leave her be. Whatever could it be that she is waiting for? With her lab coat, she's like a doctor. Maybe she's a scientist. She's trying to figure out why the water isn't talking to her. Little does she know the water doesn't give a fuck. Checking out someone, just trying to see if we could find something. I guess not. We're gonna continue on our merry way. Very linear. I like that. Ah, a blackberry bush. Its branches have kept growing even in the water. <gasps> Is there something stuck between them? Nah, probably not. Of course, there's something stuck between them. <gasps> oh, maybe I can use my little. Oh, use the umbrella. Poke it through the stick. Oh, well, I guess not. Okay, well, I tried. Chirp, chirp. So hungry, but so lazy. Hey, you on the ground. I saw you checking those bushes. Could you bring me some fruits? I can give you something nice in exchange. Chirp, chirp. <gasps> now it's a bird talking. Is this supposed to be surprising? Well, uh, it won't hurt to do that unless my hands get pricked by the thorns. Um, I actually don't support the fat and lazy, so you can just uh, get a job. Oh, no, oh, my friend's over there. Oh, well, okay, then you could just hold a gun to my head and I would do it, too. Freaking give me blackberries. That bird wanted something to eat, right? Pick blackberries. Ha this has thorns, right? Maybe this is dangerous for my hands. It will be hard to play guitar if I get them badly hurt. That is fucking true. You are a smart-ass girl. Can we use our umbrella? I don't understand how I... Oh, my God. Ah. Oh. Which one should I pick? Huh? <laughs> is it the blackberry bush? Why would you pick the green ones or the red ones? You got blackberries. Ouch, ouch. These thorns hurt more than I thought. Okay. Oh, I thought that I looked at that just for a second. I'm like, oh my God, our health is at zero out of 33. But we're okay, actually. Uh, well, maybe, okay. Dark colored, ripe blackberries. Hmm. Maybe we should give the blackberries to the black lady. What do you think? Let's try it. Ah! Okay, fine. You don't want no blackberries. Fine, I'll give the blackberries to the fat bird. They don't deserve it, though. Being big and fat and being in a... Ah! About time I filled my stomach. Thank you very much. Now, do you need anything particular? Chirp, chirp. Yeah, I need you to die. No. Not really, I think. Though, I could use something to free what is between the branches. Let's see. Maybe I do have something useful for that. Here. Will these scissors do? It's not comfortable making nests with this stuff. Here, take them. Why does this bird have scissors? Oh, thank you. That's exactly what I needed. They're a bit rusty, though. I hope they'll be of some use. Those blackberries were great. Maybe I'll go get myself next time. Ha. Probably not. People keep supporting you, you're fat. Bit rusted, better be careful. All right, we don't want to get none of that uh, typhoid fever. Huh, it looks like a bottle. Is there something inside? I think I might be able to cut some of the branches with these scissors. Cut the branches. Yes. Ah, the scissors broke. If only they had been adequate for gardening. It looks like what was stuck went down the river. Oh, well, good. I am very glad that that happened. Hello there. Did you get your message? I sure hope you did. I cannot believe this. A letter just arrived. No way. A letter? Was it inside a green bottle? Yes, it arrived through the fountain, just like they always do. If you don't mind, I will open it right now. It looks like it is not for me. It is most likely for you. What? You got glitter in a bottle. <gasps> for me? How is that? I've only been here like five minutes. Because it is. At least I know for sure it is not for me. I'll take it then. Thank you. Are you okay though? Yes, I am fine. Just a bit disappointed. I will keep waiting here. I am sure someday an answer for me will arrive. Okay, then. I hope that you get the answer to whatever you're waiting for. A glass bottle with a message inside. Oh, now we can't read it! Oh. And we have no skills! Shit. 
Okay, well, maybe we're just supposed to throw the bottle at these people over here. Hey, little bird. I should read what the letter says. That is a great idea. Let's do it. I'll be waiting. There's a key inside the bottle, too. You got golden key. Oh, good. Fine. Thank the maker. Hey, little bird. All right, you got nothing more to say. He's all satiated with his blackberryness. It's warm. It's warm. Well, yeah, because it's in the sun, and also there were people sitting on it. I'm sorry, I'm one of them perpetual savers. Alrighty, let's go. Bada boom. Oh, that's a fence. It's locked. Shit. Wait, we have a key. Hold on, hold the phone. Oh, but it's for here. It's for somewhere else. Oh, well. Is there water inside? Eh, probably. I got no idea. That kind of looks like a, a guy climbing the bush. Like when you try to... Like in the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, you gotta go up and sneak past the guards. It's locked. It seems it can be opened with a key. Well, good thing we have one. God dang it! Hey, what? Did that gate just open by itself? A scarecrow. Its colors make it look a bit like a tomato. Tomato scarecrow. Okay, and before that shitstorm, I know it's pronounced tomato. Hello. Sorry for the intrusion. Oh, it's Stella. Welcome. Tell me if you need anything. Ah, so it seems everybody really know. Oh, does know who I am? It's strange. Is it? I'd say it'd be strange if nobody knew. Excuse me, can we please explain why everybody knows who I am? There you go, that's what I want. Oh, speaking about names, mine is Wolfgang, but you can call me Wolf. What do you need? Tell me if I can help. Well, is it possible to open that fence outside? No, it's impossible. Wait, right away, just wait a, ah, wait. Oh, problem? Wait, I swear I had the key in my pocket. Where did it go? Sorry, I'm going to look for it. It will be a moment. All right, that's okay. It's not like uh, you just offered to help me. I should probably help too. That sounds like work. I don't want to deal. Okay, fine. To the bush. A potted plant, but it's not a pan plant of pot. These sacks smell of soil. Uh, and then some plants outside the window. This is a cute little area. It's like a friggin' uh... Ah, oh, what do you call those things? Where you had like the roll-up chessboards when you were a kid? A healthy looking plant. I've never seen one like this before. A box with some seed packs. Oh my God, watch as it's in him. Sorry, I can't seem to find it. Everything I see here is just jackets and hats. Uh, could it be this key? Guess not. Okay, let's think. Let's think of this through logically. If I were a key, I would always be the last place that I would look. And I would have gone from top right to top left, so maybe it's here. A sink, it seems! A stinky sink. <gasps> it would be a little bit rude to open it. Better leave it be. Uh, excuse me, we just offered to help. I disagree. Open it. Oh, God, there's probably, like, underwear in there. Oh, whoa, here's something. Ah, is someone there? Uh-oh. Ah, what? Yes, hello. Help me. Please help me. I fell in here accidentally. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, God, we could do some serious role playing here. Are you okay? Do you want me to lower the rope? Do you want me to come down there with you? It's okay, sort of. But that won't work. It'd be a bit hard for me to grab it, you see. If only there was something I could get in to pull me out of there. Like a bucket? <gasps> yes! Ah! A bucket would work. Please hurry! Um, I don't have a bucket. Why did you offer a bucket when we don't have one? Oh my god, that's like saying, Oh god, if only I had this life-saving antidote. Yes, that would work perfectly! Except for the fact that I don't have the life-saving antidote. Hello there, do you have a bucket? Sorry, I can't seem to find it. Everything I see is just jackets and hats. Yes, we could probably ask him for a bucket. Look at him, he looks like a guy who has a bucket! Oh my god! All right, if I were a bucket, where would I be? Uh, this? Wait, 
That's not a hat. Maybe I could use it for the well. Take the bucket. Please wait. This is my only hat. Oh, are you freaking? Is everything alive in this area? Is is there any way you could give it to me, or we could just take it by force? It's a freaking look at. It's all. Well, if you could find another hat for me, I could give you mine. Any kind of hat? Yes, any hat does. I'd feel very incomplete without something on my head. Um. How about a bottle? Oh my freaking. What do you need on your head? Maybe like a pot? I bet a pot would do. <gasps> nope, not a pot. Nope, not that pot either. Maybe a sack. <gasps> nope, not the sack either. Oh, god dang it. Hats! Could you lend me one if you don't mind? <gasps> sure, I have lots of them here. <gasps> you got a hat. Thank you. Oh my god, I'm gonna look so rabidashery in this hat. An ordinary straw hat. Alrighty then, we're gonna go to get this to the uh, tomato scarecrow here. Hope we'll get the bucket and then get that guy out of the well. Sorry, I'd feel incomplete without something on my head. Offer the hat. Is this one okay? <gasps> yes, it's perfect, thank you. <gasps> here, you can have my old one. You got bucket. Thank you very much. And we just don't give him the other hat? Or is he wearing one? This hat actually suits you much more. <gasps> he doesn't like the hat. That's too bad. Oh, well, we already got what we want. Have you found a bucket yet? <laughs> no. Oh. You have my thanks. Oh, my God. I guess we're just so nice. We're going to do it anyway. You have all of my thanks. <gasps> it was nothing. Glad I could help. But not many people come here. What brings you to this place? I'm looking for a friend. I was told there is someone who might know where she is. <gasps> oh, if you're talking about that person, yes, she will know. Keep following the stairway. You're... We are still on the stairway? I didn't even freaking notice. You will arrive where that person is eventually. Ah, all right, thank you. I have to find the fence key first, though. Why don't we just climb the fucking fence? Look at us, we're like a 13-year-old girl. We can do it. Well, then. Time to go back home. See you. Oh, okay. I just saved your life. You could, like, help me look for the key. Or you just leave. That's fine. <laughs> oh, well. How did that squirrel manage to fall in? That's a good question. No, nope, still not open. Oh, my God. I didn't even notice. It's like a metaphor going throughout the whole game. The stairwell going up the top. Or staircase going up the top. Seems like something important that I probably should have noticed. I apologize. Sorry, I can't seem to find it. That's fine. It has to be somewhere, right? <gasps> yeah. Oh my. Squirrel. Oh, I'm so glad to be home. I'll never leave my tree again. <gasps> that shiny thing is still up there. Ask for help. Um, do you mind if I ask for a small favor? <gasps> of course not. It'd be rude for me to say no after you'd rescue me. That's right. <gasps> well, about that shiny thing up there, I was wondering if you could give it to me. Wait. Wait, no. Sure. Just wait a second. Here. It seems to be a key. <gasps> you got fence key. Mother trucker, thank you very much. It's just what I needed. <gasps> Good to know. Okay, now here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go use it on the fence after we go talk to the guy so he can stop looking, because I bet he looks like the type of guy that would be looking indefinitely until we let him know. Um, is this the key? <gasps> Whoa, it is. Where did you find it? Ha, <laughs> uh, it was over there. Nope, it was up at the top of the tree for some reason. Well, at least now it's back. Thank you very much. Now, let's go open that fence. Good idea. There, it's open. You can now continue on your path. <gasps> Thank you very much. And thanks again for getting back my key. I shall be more careful when climbing trees from now on. You, what? You were climbing a tree and that's how I got up there? Okay, now I understand. Oh my, okay then. That seems like an interesting way for that to happen. Well, now you also have access to the entire, you know, back half of your world. This place is the best. No major worries for anyone. Just the perfect refuge. Come visit any time. You will always... Excuse me. Come visit any time. You will always be welcome here. 
Alrighty, you and your little uh, scarecrow over there. I guess that's a pretty peaceful situation. Got to agree. Whoa. I'm not dreaming, am I? I don't remember feeling sleepy at all at that event. Maybe I'm just getting used to this strange place somehow. Probably. This is a cute little village. Watches their enemies. Given any two houses, they are both have to be their favorite neighbors and least favorite neighbors, right? It's locked. The key from the bottle doesn't fit. What is the key in this bottle supposed to unlock? I'm actually wanting to know. Hmm. Oh, now we're, there were more neighbors. I will talk to that guy in just a second. Hold your shit. All right, then. I guess none of these houses are meant to be penetrated by our body. What about you? Oh, if it isn't Stella, how unusual to have visitors. Feel free to call me Luke. Hello, nice to meet you, I guess. But, uh, visitors? Do more people come here from time to time? Not really, unfortunately. But, well, here you are. How come you decided to visit? Uh, that's a good question. I didn't actually intend to. I was looking for my friend. Oh, actually, I just ended up here while looking for a friend. I'm a bit confused myself. Are you lonely without your friend? Lonely, maybe. She's probably my only friend. If she's a good friend, you will find her, surely. Unlike my missing friend, how am I supposed to write without her? Oh, what a disgrace. My beautiful riding quill has abandoned me. Calm down. It has to be somewhere, right? Such tragedy. It was probably my fault, though. Did I forget her in the library? Or maybe it was just around here where I was standing. What a terrible friend I am. Do you want me to look around? It seems I've been on a streak of finding lost items. Such kindness, fantastic. I accept your kind offer. If you check the library for me, it will be enough to earn my eternal gratitude. Oh, whoa, your eternal gratitude shit. It's one of those buildings in the upper part of town. All right, I'll go there. I hope this won't take much time, but maybe could that person be in this place? I uh, probably not. If I know anything about a game, it's locked. No, if I know anything about a game like this, it has to not be there because then the game would be over. Ah, town library. Alrighty, it's also the only place that has a sign. So I guess this might be the library. Indeed it is, but sorry, miss, we're closed right now, lizard. <gasps> oh. When will it be open? There's something I'd like to look for. We only open when the clock tree says so. Clock tree! If the clock tree doesn't say so, we can't open. That's a silly rule. What if you broke it? Do you mean the big clock without hands in the tree? The very same clock. The hands might be hidden somewhere. If you don't mind looking for more stuff other than what you already have to. I suggest you try finding them. Here's an idea. Just open the... No, I'm not going to get angry. Thanks. Time to search, I guess. Where might the hands be? Maybe in one of these houses. Oh, my God. We're going to be breaking it. How many crimes have we committed? We murdered a jellyfish. It's locked. The key from the bottle doesn't fit. Actually, we didn't even harm the jellyfish. It just sort of abducted us. We were the victim. Victim there. Oh, this clock tree. There's a strange circle in this tree. Is this a clock without hands? Oh, my. Maybe we can use... The small umbrella for one of the hands and the letter for another one. Or maybe we're supposed to uh, break into these houses and actually look for them. Oh, the library isn't open yet. Do you know when it will the clock in the tree ring? Oh, yes, the tree clock. It needs all of its hands to work. Four of them total. I guess we'll have to look for them too. Sigh. Such a hardworking soul. I should take example from it. Oh my god, there are four hands? What? 